Hello, you're watching the weekly stock market review on InstaForex TV. I'm Olga Vitkovska. Last Friday, the US stock market turned upwards sharply due to the banking sector rising with its high financial results presented by JP Morgan Chase for the second quarter. Dow Jones Industrial Average added 1.6% and closed at 12,777 points. For a week, the index had gained 0.04%. S&P 500 index also came higher by 1.7 percent and fixed at 1,356 points. All sectors closed in a green zone and the financial companies' shares were growth leaders. The indicator had contracted by 0.2 percent from the previous Friday. A high-technology Nasdaq advanced on Friday by 1.5 percent to the value of 2,908, but it had lost 1 percent for the last five sessions. The Friday rally in the best monthly session on Wall Street, which interrupted the downtrend of Dow Jones and S&P 500, observed the last six weeks in a row and five-day falling of Nasdaq and Posit. The reports unveiled on Friday demonstrated that consumer sentiment indexed by Michigan University and Thomson Reuters shrank by 72 points in July from June's reading of 73.2. In addition, China declared the country's economy economy to gain 7.6 percent annually from April to June period. This is the slowest growth for three years. These data raise chance of that People's Republic of China would advance stimulation in order to boost economic development in the second part of the year. All Dow index components except one were gathering pace during the Friday session. The list was headed by shares of major bank JP Morgan Chase, which have elevated 6% after the Financial Institute had brought to public its $5 billion profit report for the second quarter. This amount takes into account a $4.5 billion loss from failed trade operations with synthetic credit derivatives. The only company among the blue chips which papers dropped in price was Hewlett Packard. Its shares leveled down by 1.9% after the analysts of JP Morgan had caused the rating of personal computers and printers producer. Furthermore, the announcement made on Thursday by Lexmark company that it may not approve the profit forecast for the second quarter also didn't come in favor of Hewlett Packard. This was the weekly stock market review on InstaForex TV. Have a nice day. Goodbye.